No. Another day goes by where I'm just gonna rant at you guys because I don't have much to talk about. But it is Monday, it is January 30th. It is almost the last day of January. The Eagles are going to the Super Bowl! So I watched the game last night between the 49ers and the Philadelphia Eagles and they won, the Eagles. So they will be going to the Super Bowl to play the Kansas City Chiefs. And I'm very excited because I'm definitely gonna have a Super Bowl party because like, why not? Um, so I'm gonna be excited to plan for that and and get food and have a nice little Sunday Super Bowl fun time day. Yeah, I mean, I don't have much to talk to you guys about this week. I have a couple topics off the top of my head, but it was a really boring week. Again, I don't do much. I work, I sleep, I read books, I watch TV, I do homework. On the list of things that I have to talk about, the first one is how absolutely intense Philadelphia fans are. I think I've mentioned this before, but I feel like Philadelphia is its own level of crazy. And also I'm in the parking lot waiting to get my nails done. My nail tech is running late. So that's why we're just kind of hanging out. But I feel like I'm, I'm allowed to say this because I live in the suburbs of Philadelphia. Philadelphia fans are just a whole another level of crazy that I don't think is matched anywhere else across this entire country. Like nowhere else will you find the city having to prepare if the results are good or bad for basically the same outcome like for people's favorite sports teams losing or winning. When the Phillies went to the World Series, like the streets of Philadelphia were absolutely flooded. The streets were absolutely crazy and jam-packed last night. Like I have friends who live in Philadelphia and their Instagram stories were absolutely wild. Like they greased the poles so people don't climb them. That does not stop anybody. So, you know, people definitely made it all the way to the top. It was like a sea of people. Like I saw chopper footage and it's just so intense and so insane. That's why Philly, in my opinion, is called the city of brother love because there really is just no other sort of camaraderie like that anywhere else across this country like i i don't believe it it's philadelphia is the number one for showing the love that is for sure haha <laughs> the love love statue can't get it there's a dog barking but i don't see the dog there's dogs oh my god they're cute there they are there's the dogs oh hello other than that awesome exciting news the only thing i really had to talk about was oh yeah let's do a little tin hat moment you know if you have like a tin foil hat you might want to go get it you might want to wear it we'll see but i was on tiktok last week and i was just scrolling and i saw like a tiktok on my for you page that was of somebody screen recording their for you page and they were like scrolling through but the first video that I saw was of this like orb like UFO thingy that was just like floating and the guy was like, oh my God, like look at it, it's like a UFO. And then all of a sudden these fighter jets just like come after it. And then they scroll on their page and then there's another perspective of this like flying orb UFO thing. And then they keep scrolling and basically they end up showing like 10 different perspectives, I feel. It was a lot of videos of people posting about this orb like all across the country, which is kind of weird to me. You know, we're about to go down a little bit of a rabbit hole if this is not your kind of thing. Like, you know, it's fine. I feel like it would be you know it's not like it's not not impossible for people across the country to come together and like post these videos on the same day you know to kind of cause that kind of spark and controversy but it was just weird like so many different perspectives so many different random people and all the comments were other people being like i don't usually look up ufo stuff but like this has been flooding my feed and then i talked to one of my friends and i was like yo i'm not trying to get like two tinfoil hat with you but if you will for me for like five seconds i'd really appreciate it and essentially they were like no like have you been seeing the ufo videos too and we just kind of had like one of that like the spider-man memes that they're like pointing at each other and they're like eh like that's how it felt yeah i don't know i was looking at the comments of people like commenting on this tiktok video that i was watching of the person like screen recording and they were all just like yeah, I've had like tons of UFO videos or people like trying to explain like what people, like what we were seeing. There's this theory that it could be some like project called like Project Bluebeam that the government's working on supposedly to do like mass hologram projections in the sky and that that's what we were seeing, which I still think is kind of weird if they had like legitimate fighter jets like going after it, but I don't know. And then another one was like, apparently there's this video of like a specific, like a guy or something warning people saying that like, oh, like aliens are real in this very specific like alien race is going to begin to make contact in 2023. Not that the past three years have not already given us enough to deal with. Let's add aliens into the mix. So I don't know what to believe. I mean, apparently the government came out and was like, yeah, aliens are real or not aliens, UFOs are real. And you know, we just kind of ignored that because there's just been so much going on. But that's a lot to take in. Other than that, I don't know. I'm debating on trying, like,
like we're, we're switching topics here but other than that i'm really debating on trying to try my hand at doing a little gaming video every now and then now i will not become a gaming channel that's not what i do i post music related content on thursdays and vlogs on tuesdays but sometimes i feel like it would be fun to do like a little game playthrough and just have you guys hang out and watch while i did so i'm mostly saying that because with the whole show the last of us coming out on hbo max a lot of people are watching or playing the last of us for the first time and i am a big fan of julian solomita who is jenna marble's husband and i watch his gaming channel julian too and he did a playthrough of it like a while ago and i played the game when i was younger but i stopped after like a very certain point because it just kind of got difficult but i don't know i feel like it'd be fun maybe to like explore or play some like other small games but i don't know if any of you would be remotely interested in that let me know <laughs> i don't know i could try to make it happen it would be fun that's all i got for y'all today oh and then i'm also kind of trying out youtube shorts it's not something that i'm gonna commit to because i see people from both sides of it telling people who want to create content like do it don't do it but i'm gonna give it a try and see what happens i'm not promising like a specific style of shorts that you're gonna get from me or anything like that but if you see them check them out and we'll see if it's something that i do continue with but other than that i mean that's all i got for you guys this week i apologize for the extraordinarily short video and just the really quick like car kind of chat anywho if you're new here my name is pile and it's really nice to meet you if you're a returning viewer welcome back it's so nice to have you back i post vlogs on tuesdays and music related content on thursdays and if you liked anything that you saw on my channel or from this video definitely subscribe to my channel if you want to you don't have to, but it would definitely help me out if you did. And like and comment on this video. Again, if you want to, you do not have to, but it definitely would help me out if you did. And I will catch up with you guys next week, hopefully with some more exciting things slash a longer video. But I'll talk to you later. Bye.